Well, fashions for the coming fall season are all over the fashion magazines, and one way to spruce up any look is with accessories. Joining us is Susie Yalov Schwartz, executive fashion editor of Glamour Magazine. Good morning, Susie. Good morning, Julie. I love your necklace. Thank you. Is I that got... one of the trends for this fall? It is. Big, a chunky. Big statement necklace. It dresses up anything. I'm wearing something really basic just to show how you can dress up something basic with a great piece. A lot of stuff that we're seeing in addition to big statement pieces like your necklace is fringe and feathers. Fringe and feathers. It's all about decorative pieces and nothing does it better than accessories to take your bland wardrobe into something really interesting and fun and trendy. So what did you bring okay, today? Okay, this is Nine West. This big black tote. This big black tote. It's about a little bit under $150 and I love it. This carries everything. It's chic. It's the one bag that you should buy just to take to work or to take anywhere that you go. And the boots and this bag are also Nine West. But it all derived from a trend that came from the Michael Kors runway here. And Burberry, as you can see, did this one clutch. And this is pressed leather. But we have an item here. This is from Limited, and that's about $49. So the Burberry one looks like feathers, but it's not at all. It's feather-ish. <laughs> it's feather-inspired, as Absolutely. they say. Absolutely. All right, belts. Talk to me about what's going on with belts this Okay, fall. well, last season we saw the big tenty dress that we're all sick of and don't want to see it anymore. So now we're saying give it a waste. And how we did that is elasticized belts are really great. These are actually from Express, so they're not very expensive. This one's by Kenneth Cole, and it just takes in the waist and it makes your old wardrobe look very new. Now, if you're gonna take in the waist of your big tenty dress from last season, does it have to be with a thick belt? Can you do it with a thinner one? Well, I feel that thick belts are more directional this season. We saw them on the runways at Oscar de la Renta, and it's actually replacing the it bag, so you need the it belt this season. Okay, lots of jewels, things are bedazzled, bejeweled this season. Right, and we have these Santi bags, which are under $100, and they're great. And you want a jeweled clutch to really dress up something, again, like a little black dress. It's a great way to accessorize, and even jewels on the shoes. With the recession, people want luxury items right now. They want to feel when they look down at their feet or at their bag that they're encrusted in jewels, and this is definitely a great way to do it. I love these Prada and Burberry. Now, Isn't that amazing? They are. That Burberry gray clutch is amazing. I don't even want to know how much it is. But it's a lot. All, all of the, yeah, that's why it's <laughs> But it's Burberry. worth it. All of these things are only for evening, though, that we're looking at, right? They are actually, you can wear something like this in the day. Uh, this purple uh, flat. Yeah, the purple flat on a weekend. I mean, this is something, it's $29. You can run around the city wearing it, but it's also fun. People aren't stuck with the rules anymore. They're wearing, you know, 10 a.m. has to work for 10 p.m. these days. Okay. Now, finally getting to the big statement pieces like your fabulous necklace. Thank you. You bought really big, chunky necklaces are the thing to wear this fall. They really made such a big splash on the runways this season. I like these two. These are from Ben and Moon, the big oversized locket necklaces. They're a bit pricey in the $500 range, but yet you can get something like this from Banana Republic and that's $79 or these express for 24. Wow. Now let me ask you something about the Banana Republic piece because it has turquoise mixed in with these like amberish type stones. Turquoise can carry through after Labor Day. It's not too summery. No, turquoise is great, especially when you mix it with a stone like that. It gives it an added dimension and it's something you wouldn't actually expect to be mixed together. And that's what makes it look really new this season. Okay. Explain to me the shoe boot right. now actually has a peep toe. It's so funny because I was talking to Dave Price about it. And he's like, I don't like those shoes at all. I mean, but these are the most important shoes of the season. The peep toe shoe booty. And we're seeing it all over the runways. And the way to wear it is you take a very feminine dress and you mix it with the shoe booty. So it's kind of feminine mixed with something tough. Do I have to wear a hosiery with it? You don't, tight. you don't have to, but you can. So the old rule of not having your hosiery show through the peep toe, because you're going to be seeing peep toes everywhere, disregard that. Because a lot of people, you want to wear opaque. You don't want to wear nude. All right, the and rules And this is of by fashion. Nine West, Aldo, and this one's Giuseppe Zonetti. Susie Yellow Schwartz, thanks so much. We're out of time. So okay. if you want to know about these fedoras, but go to our website. But you do need a fedora. <laughs> yes, you have to find out about it on our website, earlyshow.cbsnews.com.